Ang said, you may not realize this, but one in 26 people in the United States will develop epilepsy at some point in their lifetime. This weekend, we've partnered with the Epilepsy Foundation to help with a net -a -thon to raise money and awareness through an online campaign. Joining us to talk more about this important mission is Howard Zwern. He is a board member with the Epilepsy Foundation right here in Chicago. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here with us. So tell us about your personal journey with epilepsy. Sure. So around 28, I was diagnosed with having epilepsy. Uh, I went for approximately, we knew nothing about it. My family never heard about it. We ended up contacting the Epilepsy Foundation of Greater Chicago to learn about epilepsy, what it means, what people do, how they can get support at that point. Um, I had gone through about seven years mm -hmm. of taking different types of medications, still having seizures, um, didn't really impacted, you know, slowed down on certain things I was doing with my family. Um, uh, after around seven years, when we were learning we were gonna have our first child, Rachel, um, we decided because of the medications weren't solving stopping the seizures. Like it controlled them, but I still had them. Mm -hmm. Mine were mostly related to stress. Other people, there's no really control. A lot of people I know that with the foundation and that we see, um, you know, have seizures 10 a day. So you were able to control it by having an operation then? And so I went and had surgery okay. and they removed the left temporal mm. portion of my brain that was impacted. And again, 13 years, knock on wood, after having our second daughter, Meredith, I'm fortunate enough to not have a seizure since then. Well, that is a very powerful testimony that you've yes. got there. Thanks so much for joining us. Again, the Netathon raising money for awareness for yes. individuals just as yourself so they can get relief from this. Absolutely, absolutely. It's a great, we appreciate everyone's support. Um, again, eight hours today. Um, I believe it's on the news today Correct. and the it's website. It's going to be on our website. Absolutely. That's right. We appreciate everyone dialing in and listening. Fantastic. Well, again, the reminder, the Epilepsy Netathon with actor Greg Grunberg as well is this afternoon from noon until 8. Log on to cbslocal.com slash epilepsy to take part.